Ugh, humans are the worst. Hey cutie, feeling like some ice cream after this? My treat. Dang, Aiden's still here? Ugh, whatever, rule number one. Remember, no, falling for humans. This party looks lit. I want to hang with Aiden, but butterflies are going crazy in my stomach. Come on, Marinus, let's, let's bust a move. I'm not sure. Don't be shy. You're gorgeous. Own it. The world needs to see your beauty. I have something to say. Huh? I really like you. Marinus, you won't believe what happened today. What was that? I got an offer from a famous NBA college. That's amazing, Aiden. I knew your talent would be recognized. What did they say? They offered me a scholarship to a basketball college. Can you believe it? I never thought something like this would happen to me. I always believed in you, Aiden. Your skills are extraordinary. And I knew one day someone would see it too. This is your chance to shine. But what about us? I don't want to be away from you, Dios Marinus. I can't imagine my life without you by my side. Aiden, our love is strong, and distance won't change that. I want to see you succeed, and I'll be right here, cheering you on every step of the way. Thank you, Marinus. I couldn't ask for a better partner with you by my side. I know I can do anything. Oh, sorry. I didn't see you there. Watch where you're going, loser. You think you're so special now, huh? Just because Aiden chose you over me? I didn't ask for any of this. Aiden and I have feelings for each other, and there's nothing wrong with that. There is something wrong with it. Aiden was supposed to be mine. We were supposed to be together. I understand that you're hurt, but you can't force someone to love you. Aiden made his choice. And it's not fair for you to take it out on me? Oh, look at you, all innocent and perfect. Acting like you're better than everyone else because you stole Aiden away. I didn't steal anyone away. Aiden and I have a connection. And it's not for you to judge or try to destroy. You think you're so tough, huh? Well, I promise you this. Marinus, I won't leave you alone. I'll make your life a living hell. You can try all you want. Aiden and I have something special, and nothing you do can change that. We'll see about that, Marinus. Don't care. We'll see. Still don't care. Huh? Hey, Aiden. How's the packing going? It's tough, Marinus. I can't believe I'm actually leaving all of this behind. What if I don't fit in at the basketball college? Aiden, you're an incredible basketball player. They'd be lucky to have you. You'll fit in just fine, I promise. But what about you? I don't want to leave you behind either. I'll miss you, Bay. I'll miss you too, Bay. But this is an incredible opportunity for you. I'll come visit you every week. And we can video chat whenever we want. You'd really do that for me. Of course, Aiden, I'll always be here for you, no matter the distance. Thank you, Marinus. Well, well, well. Look who we have here. The inseparable duo, saying their goodbyes. Oh, look who decided to grace us with his presence. You know, Marinus, I can't help but wonder how long you'll be able to keep Aiden's attention. Once he's surrounded by all those talented basketball players at college, you're just the past. Enough, Adam. 
Don't talk to my bay like that. Aiden, don't let him get to you. We know who we are and what we mean to each other. You won't always be there to protect him, Aiden. Mark my words. Promise me you'll take care of yourself, Aiden. Don't forget to eat well and get enough rest. I love you. More than words can express. I love you too. Always have. Always will. Goodbye, Bay. Until we meet again. Goodbye, Aiden. Take care of yourself. Look who decided to show up. What do you want, Adam? Oh, nothing much. Just thought we could have a little chat. Look, I don't want any trouble. Just let me go. Oh, we're not done here yet, Marinus. You've been getting cozy with someone lately and, huh? That's none of your business, Adam. Leave Aiden out of this. Oh, I don't think Aiden would know what happened here today. Just leave me alone, Adam. You don't know anything about me. Oh, I think I know enough. You're weak, Marinus. And weak people like you deserve to be put in their place. You can try to break me, Adam, but you won't succeed. You think you're so tough, huh? Let's see how tough you are when no one's around to protect you. Sick my back. I think he'd love that. This is a warning, Marinus. Everything's just a beginning. You'll regret this one day. Oh, please. Why, it makes me happy. Marinus, what happened? Why do you smell like garbage? It's nothing, Mom. Just some stupid prank at school. I can handle it. Marinus, you need to see this. The Elemental Academy is in pursuit of a dangerous criminal who escaped from jail this morning. They believe he's hiding in the human world. But what does that have to do with me, Mom? Marinus, if it's not safe for you here, you need to come back with me to the Elemental City. Our home is protected, and the Academy will ensure your safety. But Mom, I don't have any powers. What difference would it make if I go back? Marinus, your powers will awaken when the time is right. You're still discovering who you are, and your journey is just beginning. Don't underestimate yourself. I want to believe that, Mom. I want to be strong and protect myself, but right now, I feel so helpless. You are not alone in this, Marinus. We are here for you, every step of the way. Remember, strength comes in many forms. Thank you, Mom. I'll do my best to stay safe. I know you will, Marinus. I won't let your son go this time. Hey, Aiden. How was your first day at the basketball college? It was incredible, babe. The coaches are amazing, and the facilities are top-notch. I can already tell this is going to be a life-changing experience. That's great, Aiden. I'm so happy for you. I wish I could be there with you, experiencing it all. Hey, Big Bay. Is everything okay? You sound a little off. Did something happen? Oh, it's nothing, really. Just a long day at school. Don't worry. All right, if you say so. Just remember, I'm here for you, Bay. Whenever you're ready to talk, I'm all ears. Thank you, Aiden. You're the best. But I should let you get some rest. Tomorrow is a big day for you. You're right, I should get some sleep. Good night, Bay. I love you. Good night, Aiden. I love you too. 
Sweet Dream. Oh, poor you. Mom, look. Marinas, you made the rose bloom. I... I don't know how I did it, Mom. It just happened. I touched the rose, and it came back to life. Marinas, this is extraordinary. It seems your powers are awakening. But what does this mean, Mom? What am I supposed to do with these powers? Marinas, these powers are a gift. They come with great responsibility. You have a unique ability to heal the world around you. You're right, Mom. I won't let this gift go to waste. I'll learn to control these powers for the greater good. I know you will, Marinas. I believe in you. Remember, your powers are a reflection of your kind heart and your desire to make a difference in the world. Thank you, Mom. I'm so grateful to have you by my side, guiding me through this journey. I'll always be here for you, Marinas. Guys, do it! Adam, why? Why do you take pleasure in hurting others? What have I ever done to deserve this? Oh, poor Marinus, always playing the victim. You think you're so special, but you're just a weakling. We're just having some fun. No, Adam. This isn't fun. It's bullying. It's tearing people down to make yourself feel better. You think you know everything, and don't you? Maybe I just wanted to feel powerful for once. Help! Adam, look at him. What? It's possible. Adam, I think it's a soul. Ghost. Run for your life. Who are you? Who am I? What the heck just happened? Marinus, thank goodness you're awake. I'm sorry I left you alone. I should have been there for you. Aiden, it's not your fault. You had your dreams to pursue, and I understand that. I would never blame you for what happened. I'm just glad you're here now. Bay, next week I have a basketball tournament. I want you to be there, cheering me on from the stands. Will you come? Of course, Aiden. I'd love to come and cheer you on. Marinus, we need to talk. The situation with the dangerous criminal, Kurt, has escaped. It's no longer safe for you to stay here. We have to prioritize your safety and bring you back to the Elemental Academy. But Mom, Aiden's tournament is next week. I promised him I would be there. Can't we wait a little longer? I know how much this means to you, Marinus, and I'm sorry. But our priority is keeping you safe. The Academy has resources and protection that we can't provide here. We can't afford to take any risks. I understand, Mom. Safety comes first. But I can't help feeling disappointed. Aiden has always been there for me. And now, I won't be able to be there for him. Marinus, true love withstands distance and time. Aiden will understand that your safety is important. And when the time is right, you'll be able to reunite and cheer him on in person. You're right, Mom. I just hope Aiden knows how much he means to me and how much I wish I could be there for him. He knows, Marinus. Your bond with Aiden is strong. Babe, I'm sorry I can't not attend your tournament. I understand, Bay. Why don't you ask the reason? Because I know. If it's not something important, you won't cancel. Thanks, Bay. Here, Aiden. Come on, play nice.